I, I strongly believe that we've got the squad of players who can do that. And uh, yeah, we've got a few missing in terms of injuries and a, a few international call-ups. But so have every other team, and uh, we've known that beforehand. We need to make sure that the players who play play well. And uh, at the moment, we're not just playing on top of our game. We can do better, and uh, I'm determined that we'll get the team right and we'll do it on Sunday. Last season, you went down to Wales to play the Ospreys, and that was one hell of a tough game. You're expecting the same this weekend from the Dragons? Definitely. I think uh, we went down to Ospreys. I think we took a lot of the England lads who had just returned from international duty. We took a very strong team down there. They played, which was looked like a second team on paper, and, and it was a massive test. And, and that's what happens when an English team goes down to play in Wales. It's going to be exactly that on Sunday. Uh, it, it's uh, on on camera it's it's live on tv which will mean there's probably more people up for it even more it's going to be tough and uh, we've got to make sure we're fully prepared and uh, if we do that then we've got a good chance of winning just a quick word on the Saints squad last week you played a lot of guys who you'd see as regular first teamers um England players coming back as well. Will you consider a strong side again this weekend? Yeah, I think uh, what we've got to do is we've got to make sure that we're prepared and the players are playing enough rugby. And uh, certainly some of the players who have had a week or two off, uh, some of those international players need to come back and they need to be involved this weekend. And uh, you'll, you'll, you'll see that happening on Sunday. T, last week you got your chance off the bench for the first team. You've played Premiership and LV Cup rugby before. Is this an area of the season you look forward to? Yeah, it's a big part of the season I think for us young fellas uh, it gives us opportunity to show the coaches what we can do um, and uh, yeah play plenty of Wanderers rugby that's been going quite well lots of wins uh, decent performances as well does that help you when you make that step up to the first team yeah I think so it, um, Dicko and Hoppers really drill it into us that we could be playing in that shirt next week or whenever so we always want to play hard play good like get our names uh, into the coach's office and stuff. Do the first team coaches come to you as well and just sort of explain their plan for the season? Do they tell you maybe this is the time of the year that you will get your chance? Yeah, yeah. They're always saying LV's our time to shine. If we get chosen, um, make it hard for them not to choose us again. So, yeah. How much do you look at sort of the players in the past who've put their hands up during these games and gone on to win first team honours? Is that plenty of encouragement for you? Yeah, yeah, it is like the likes of uh, Ben Nutley, Mikey Haywood, Jamie Elliott. They've um, they were all in the academy last year, and they've they've taken the opportunity. They've uh, done well, so I think we all look look to them for. Uh, yeah, obviously you're seen as a very exciting prospect for the Saints. Um, you've you've had your chance in the first team. How close do you think you are to making that step up and actually really putting your hand up week in week out? Um. <laughs> Not not too far off, I hope. Uh, I hope to be in there next year, hopefully, if not sooner. But, um, yeah, it's all in learning, I think, experience. Uh, yeah, my time will come whenever. I just hope it's soon. And looking at the guys around the club in the back uh, in the back row, you've got Callum, Dalfs, Woody, uh, GJ, a new guy in, but are they the kind of guys that you pick up a lot of little bits from and, and sculpt your game? Yeah, yeah, you know, um, training alongside them, um, playing with them. You know, you're always going to pick up little bits and pieces of their gameplay that you can always add to yours. So uh, I think it's it's a good it's good having so much good players in front of you. I think I think if um, if you make the team, you know you you're good.